My name's Mel, welcome to my world, and if you're new to my channel, at the moment I'm building a stealthy, off-grid, go anywhere, sleep anywhere, camper van for my adventures in the summer. So, at the moment I've got a bed base, um, that's where my bench is going to go, more about that in a minute. There's my work surface with my cooker and sink under there, well grill anyway, well not grill, gas ring, that's it, gas ring under there. Um, today I'm going to be doing my workbench hopefully i haven't got a lot of time because it is getting dark well, it's just starting to get dark um i've had to go work yes i do work um so yeah today i'm going to build me bench along there that's my my mission for today if i can get that bench done today i'll be happy now normally ordinarily when i've done this in the past i've just put planks planks across there like that and made a bench all the way along but in this van i want to make it so i can lift it open to get to my fridge i'm going to put my fridge under the bench a bit of safe uh not safe space saving <laughs> now i need to kind of uh try and do some sort of hinge system along here that's going to allow me to open the bit the base of the bench of tongue twister because i'm rushing right so yeah you get the picture i've got to lift this up but at the same time i've got to allow room for doors to open there so that's what i've got to do oh hang on Something a bit odd going on outside. <laughs> Have a look at this. I think that's illegal being on the phone and in control of a horse at the same time. Right, so I figured it out. Did you see the guy on the phone? Riding the horse. <laughs> it's on the phone of horse and cart. That's got to be illegal, surely. Anyway, um, little break there. <laughs> so I've figured out what I'm going to do now. Um, I've put some stops here. Look, some little, these are level with this edge, so that now this piece, I've just screwed this on there, just roughly to as a step. You see the step? That's just two pieces screwed together. That's going to go on there like that. Oh, there goes my hinges. See, so that gives me a step. I don't know if you can see that, it's getting dark now. Like that. And then these will go like that. And then a piano hinge along here. This is a piano hinge. That's going to go in there. And then that will lever up like that. And it brings it level with this. So my door will be like just in on the inside edge of that maybe i'll have that out just a fraction to make sure it clears and that's how I'm, that's how i'm gonna do my bench and the hinges are gonna work there you go it's quite simple really yeah quite pleased with that and the reason for this lip here is so that this rests on there and takes the weight because i'm going to stand on this to get into bed so it needs to be quite strong and i think if i just have a piano hinge against there like that that's not going to take the weight, I don't think. So this little lip will help support the weight as I stand on it. You know, look, I could probably stand on it now and it won't, that's not even screwed down yet. So that works. Right, get sawing and screwing and stuff. Back in a minute. God, it's getting dark. <laughs> right, I'm going to rush, but I'm not going to budge it. Oh, blimey, I've got a bit of a red nose going on. It's starting to look like Rudolph. It's not very attractive, is it? Right, so I've made my lid, that's my lid and also the, the bench and it's simply just slats of wood screwed together with two battens. Now I've only put one screw in each, um, what's the word, each length of wood. But once I've squared it all up I'll put two in and that'll hold it square, if that makes sense. Yeah I'm sure it does. Right, so here we go, this is what it's going to look like gonna sit in there like that. You can see I could I could sit on that now with that and I've not even put the hinge on yet. And that's the whole point of that little lip. That lip there to give it support. So all I need to do now is attach the piano hinge. Cut it to length and that's gonna go down in between there like that. Can you see that? Yeah that'll go down that disappear in that gap. The only problem is I need some more screws, so I've got to go shops and get some more screws. Um, 
Now when I attach this, I'm not going to attach it in situ like that. This piece here, I'm going to take that off. There's only I've only put one screw each side, so I can take that off and then do it up there or do it on the bench or whatever. It just makes it easier to, to assemble it. So this will all be assembled as one piece and then I'll screw the whole thing down. I'll show you what it looks like when it's all off before I fit it into place. Otherwise I'll get told off. Someone told me off for not showing enough detail. So uh, I'm trying, I'm trying to show you as much detail as I can. Right, um, so yeah, I've got to go shops now, get some screws. For the piano rooms, I've forgotten. My nose look red. I think I've got cold. So I've done it. There's me, um, there you go. Self explanatory. My piano hinges along there. And that's like that. That's how it's going to work. So this, this piece here will support the weight of the step. You see, it locks underneath. I hope, that's, um, I hope that makes sense in some way. Does my nose look red? Yeah. Cold coming, I think. So now that we'll flip round, go in there like that. There you go. Oh, can't see it. Hang on. What's going on here? The gimbal's not working. Oh, there you go. Right. Yeah, I've got a gimbal. <laughs> So now all I've got to do is screw this down and that's in place. A little hinge like that. And again that that rib, that ridge there will help will support the weight of it, not, not, not the hinge. So the piano hinge isn't supporting the weight. There you go. Perfect. Right, next job, put two screws in. Four screws even. Success! It's a success story. Look at that. There you go. So this is my bench, well, my seat, I'll sit on there and also it's a step to step into the bed and then it doubles up as a hatch for my fridge. Now I'm going to put some sort of catch on this to hold it up, so that's going to be horrible otherwise. There you go, and there's the fridge under there. So pull that, there's that, there you go. That's it. Now I'll take a seat, oh, take a load off my feet, chill out for a bit fridge under me bum, keep me beers cold, what more could you ask for, okay, that's it, I'm done, I'm cold, I'm un well I'm not cold actually, my heat is going, <laughs> just got used to saying that, yeah, the heat is lovely and toasty, um, but yeah, enough about the heat, I'm done with talking about the heater, <sighs> yeah, I'm over it, right, I'm off, so if you like this video, give me a thumbs up, um, leave a comment below, feel free to chat amongst yourselves, Thanks for watching and uh, don't forget to subscribe. See you later.